In this video, we're going to dive into the world of insert edits in Final Cut Pro. It's all about smoothly adding clips to your timeline, and I'll walk you through different ways to make it happen. Ready? Let's do this. First up, the simple drag and drop method. Just grab your clip from the browser, drop it between your timeline clips, and watch the space open up. Release the mouse, and there you go. Remember, adding clips this way shifts everything to the right, making your project a bit longer. Want to insert multiple clips? Easy. Command click on the ones you want and drag them into your timeline. Now, let's explore more ways to insert clips. Place the playhead where you want to insert your clip. You can activate the snapping tool to ensure the playhead snaps right to the intersection. Just click on this icon with two rectangles or use the keyboard shortcut N. Now select your clip, click the insert button, or use the shortcut W. Boom, your clip is now inserted at the playhead. Adding a clip within a clip will split the clip into two segments. Let me demonstrate. Place the playhead at the clip's midpoint. When we insert a clip in this spot, it cuts the clip at the playhead position, creating space for the new clip. Before we move on, would you mind sharing some positive vibes by giving that thumbs up button a gentle tap? Not only does it let me know if I'm doing a fantastic job explaining things, but it also helps others in discovering this video. Much appreciated! At times, you might need to make room for a clip that's not quite ready. Here's what you do. First, put the playhead where you want it. Then, up in the menu bar, click on Edit, then Insert Generator, and pick Gap or Placeholder. Or you can simply hit Command Option W for a placeholder, or press Option W for a gap. Easy peasy. Placeholders and gaps act like video clips. You can adjust their length by dragging the ends. Placeholders show a sample image, while gaps show an empty screen. When you have the clip ready, just overwrite the gap without messing up your project layout. Just select Replace from Start. Inserting clips might not always be your go-to, but it's a handy tool in your toolbox. Now that you're a pro at Insert Edits, let's explore slugs in Final Cut Pro. I'll teach you how to add, edit, and even share some hacks for one-click slugs. Ready for the next step? Click here to check it out.